Hello and welcome everybody to the walk around video here at Your Next Car of the 2017 335D M Sport GT. The vehicle is presented in the black sapphire metallic. Not only does it feature the warranty starting enhancement package, this vehicle comes with some very, very sought after BMW options. Starting with the front of the car then, a nice obvious place to start. We've got the gloss black kidney grills. The headlamps are the BMW Adaptive LED headlamps, as you can see there. With the adaptive versions of the LED headlights, of course, that's going to give you nicer, brighter vision alongside the fact that they will move with the direction of the steering input. We've got the original BMW 19 inch M Sport alloy wheels. We've had those professionally refurbished in jet black. Behind them, you'll see the M Sport Plus brakes, as this GT does come with the M Sport Plus package. It's got a full glass panoramic roof. And again, I'll show you both the tilted and slid full back version of that in a moment. We've got the gloss aero mirror caps, sun protection glazing on the rear windows, a really, really nice Oyster Dakota leather that does come with both the memory, electric movement, and of course, heated front seats. And it's a really nice color combination of the lighter interior and the black sapphire exterior. Harman Kardon audio with, of course, that plus package. We have got the eight speed sports automatic gearbox, which is connected to our very, very nice intelligent X drive four wheel drive system. If we go to the back, the GT3 series, as this one is, of course, comes with tons and tons of space for both passengers and luggage. As you can see there, both the front seats are set into a position of a regular seating position, I suppose. And there you can see just how much space there is for rear passengers. And you can see how much light that panoramic roof is going to allow into the car. Really nice feature that is. Again, those wonderfully freshly refurbished alloy wheels. Another feature I like about the GTs is this electrically operated rear spoiler. So you can have it up or down. Again, it's a nice little quirk to have something like that. There is, of course, a bit of purpose to it, but we won't go too far into that in this video. In the boot then, of course, it's a huge, huge area. You've got split folding seats. The tailgate itself is fully electrical. As you've seen there, we'll come around the other side and give you a little bit of a better display of it. And we'll close the boot down and head to the driver's side for you, where again, you can see that lovely black sapphire metallic. This one does come with four 360 view cameras, including a rear camera and front and rear sensors. And I will, of course, give you a view of that in a moment. We'll now go through and take a quick seat inside the car so I can get the car started up and go through a few of the interior features. We've got power folding mirrors, as you can see there. And if we get the car started up, we'll go through some of the features on this lovely professional wide nav and media screen. So there, as soon as we've started with it, we'll go through the media and radio systems. We've got DAB, music collection, online entertainment, USB and Bluetooth line in. We've got a nice big widescreen to take a look at our navigation. It's a very low mileage car, having only covered just over 33,000 miles, which not only for the age, especially the type of car that it is, but of course with that humongous three and a half litre or three litre twin turbo engine up front, it's no mileage whatsoever for this car. You'll see the two lines in between the rev counter and speedometer. That is because we have got the intelligent safety system on the car. So if I turn those off, you can see we've got collision warning and pedestrian alert, as well as we have got the lane departure warning. Let's click the car into reverse. That'll bring up the first camera. So as you can see, that's the rear camera. If I go across to the sub menu and then click across, that'll bring up, give me the option to have a full 360 view. Press park, stop that beeping away. It gets a little bit irritating. In terms of communication, then we've got regular Bluetooth audio and telephone, as well as Apple CarPlay on this car. Again, another nice feature. And if we open up the armrest, you'll see in here, we have also got the wireless charging dock. So of course you can keep everything charged up whilst you're playing your multimedia systems, front heated seats, dual climate controls. The car does need a set of brake pads. However, we will take care of that and they'll all be sorted prior to a viewing on the car. However, the service itself, 15,000 miles till that's due. Service history wise, really good service history for this car. Full BMW, as you can see there. And as I've just mentioned, we'll update that when we have changed the front pads. Brake fluid was done, time before that, service. And we'll give you one last look. And again, the time before that, another service there. So very nicely looked after car, extensively optioned 
list on this car, an extensive, extensive option list is the word I'm looking for. Really nice drive on the 335D M Sport GT. For any further info, do see the links below. Thank you very much. Take care. Bye-bye.